Senegal's head of state Basil Diomaye continues his West African style of diplomatic visits aimed at strengthening regional cooperation. Guinea-Bissau is the third stop on the Senegal's president's tour since its inauguration in April. After Mauritania and Gambia, he will visit his Saudi neighbor Guinea-Bissau. This walking visit to review bilateral agreements between the two countries will only last for a few hours. Guinea-Bissau and Senegal share a border of more than 300 kilometers, along which a rebellion has been raging for almost 40 years, that of the Kasaman independent fighters. Guinea-Bissau is also mediating in his long-running conflicts and the issue could be raised when the two leaders meet. The other issue is the demarcation of their common maritime border, an ill-defined border that is subject of a dormant dispute for which the solutions proposed so far have produced no results. The thorny issue of unlicensed Chinese trawlers, which dock in Guinea-Bissau waters, and bycatches from Senegalese artisanal fishermen could also be addressed. On the security front, around 100 Senegalese troops remain in Guinea-Bissau as part of the Economic Community of West African State Standby Force, whose mandate was renewed for another year last December. On Guinea-Bissau's side, relations between the two countries are governed by all traditions, whereby the head of state, once sworn in, chose Dakar for their first visit.